October 25, 1962. In New York, the Cuban Missile Crisis takes center stage at the United Nations Security Council. Ambassador Adlai Stevenson presents photographic evidence of Soviet missile bases in Cuba. Stevenson challenges Soviet Ambassador Valerian Zorin in this memorable Cold War exchange. You're in the court of world opinion right now, and you can answer yes or no. You have denied that they exist. I want to know if, you, if, this, if I've understood you correctly. Continue your statement, please. You will receive the answer in the due course. Do not worry. <laughs> I'm prepared to wait for my answer until hell freezes over, if that's your decision. 1971. China's seat at the United Nations changes hands. The UN General Assembly votes to admit communist mainland China and expel Taiwan. 1983. An American-led force invades Grenada to oust a leftist government allied with Cuba and the Soviet Union. President Ronald Reagan calls the action necessary to protect U.S. citizens on the Caribbean island nation. 1854. The battle that inspires the poem, The Charge of the Light Brigade, happens during the Crimean War. An English brigade of more than 600 men, facing hopeless odds, charges Russia's army during the Battle of Balaclava and suffers heavy losses. 1400. Geoffrey Chaucer author of the Canterbury Tales, one of English literature's greatest works, dies in London. In 1999, golfer Payne Stewart and five others are killed when their Learjet crashes in South Dakota after flying uncontrolled for four hours. Stewart was 42 years old. Today in History, October 25th, Carlotta Bradley, The Associated Press.